Welcome to PBI Bridge Edit tool. If you want to use line chart with the smooth lines, you need to click on Modify Visual. Once you reached on this screen, if you are a first time user, you need to register with us by clicking on this blue link. After registration, you need to put your email ID and password and then login. Once you are here, you need to click on library. Go to the particular visual which you want to import. Import it from here. And here are you. There is another way to log in on this page. After login, for the second time when you click on modify visual, The system will automatically take you to visual editor page. Once the editor screen opens up, let me give you a very quick overview the way it organized. The left panel is all about charts and data fields. The middle panel is all about formatting options for your visual. And the right panel is where you select your data as well as see the rendering of your visual. One thing to notice the data used here is a sample data but when you export the visual the data will be used what you have in Power BI. So if you connecting to a SQL database or an Excel file or any other data source you would see that this sample data will not be associated with the exported visual. So this is just for demonstration purpose or looking at how the visual looks like. On the upper section you can switch on multiple visual editors and export your visual. We have some additional settings also. And we have documentation for your help as well. For users who wants to use it right away, we have already created a visual for you. All you need to do is go to export visual and fill this data. If you want to change this name, you can change it or you can leave it as it is as per you like. Put your name here, your email ID, one important thing to notice. Change this UID by clicking refresh. This is important because this UID has to be unique for your visual. So when you are using this visual in your Power BI dashboard, this ID has to be unique. It should not have a conflict with any other UID from the marketplace or any of the visual you might use before. If you are doing an update to the visual and this is not your first time, we recommend keeping the GUID same because that will help you with the update. But if you are not updating and this is your very first download, please click on this refresh button. This will ensure that there is no conflict with any other marketplace visual. In the field section, we have selected some important details, but if you want to use some other you can just check or uncheck from here as you want in your visual. Same with the format. Here we have multiple options which you can select or unselect by click. In the plots, you can select line color, line opacity, connect gaps, line thickness. All these options you select here, you will get in your Power BI visual when you import this visual. All of these options should be enough for your visual. If you are opting to a single time download, I would recommend you to choose all options because you will not get second chance after you pay and download. So we recommend tick all the options. Those are here. If you are on a subscription plan, however, we recommend selecting the options that are necessary. This will help avoid cluttered in your power BI visual. 
dashboard. If you need another visual, you can always come back and select additional option or deselect them. Okay, once we are ready and we are satisfied with all the changes, we recommend you to export the free visual. Try it out and when you are happy, you can go and make a purchase by clicking this pay and export button. There is a subscription option as well. So if I click on export now, it will take a minute or two. It's depending upon how busy is this server. As you can see here, visual has been downloaded successfully. Let's go to the Power BI and explore our visual. To import a visual, we need to click on these three dots. Go to import a visual from a file. import go to the red ribbon folder where you have downloaded your visual open it as you can see here this little tiny icon just click it and we have our visual let's drag it a little bit more make some space now i'm going to fill my data fields here in y1 i put black me In Y2, Himalaya. Now let's do a little bit formatting of visual. Increase basic size. Now X axis and Y axis looking good, but you can change always by going there and you can change a color as you want of your axis, label, label prefix, suffix, spike line, grid lines if you want to off them, just click off and they will be gone. But I want them, so I am going to own them. In plots, you can change line color, line opacity, line thickness, just drag it little. or decrease you can select line style solid dot dash long dash dash dot long dash dot 
लाइन से मार्कर कलर मार्कर ओपेसिटी मार्कर साइज सिंबल ऑफ मार्कर फोन साइज टू लेबल You can also change general setting of your visual, like title if you want. Custom title you can put just here. Effects. You can change background color, transparency, visual border if you want to shadow. Just on it. There is a shadow here. You won't need that. So you can change your basic settings, general settings here also. Like this, I hope you are able to create some powerful insights using this smooth line chart. And do let us know if you face any issue by contacting us through the email provided on our website. Thank you so much.